Sonny Ng discovered the hard way that getting late night cash from his local Chase ATM is no longer an option. The ATMs were locked. Um, if there was a sign that said the hours of operation for the ATM uh, ends at 10 p.m. ATMs usually 24 hours, um, especially given that we, you know, we live in New York. It's a city that never sleeps. So he tweeted at Chase, and to his surprise, the company wrote back saying, "We decided to close several ATM vestibules at 5 p.m. or 6 p.m. due to rising crime and vagrancy that occurred in these previously 24/7 vestibules." If like crime or you know vagrancy is a problem, they could have like a private security guard there, which I have seen in the past before. Another Chase customer who works late nights as a bartender sees the problem, but also uses the ATMs overnight to deposit his tips. Oftentimes we have like homeless people just hanging out in here, and uh, you know makes it it's not very safe. I work at night, I, I get out really late, uh, so I like to deposit my cash right after work, and it's, I'm unable to do that now. In a statement, Chase tells PIX11 News, for the safety of our customers and employees, we may temporarily close some ATMs overnight. We can't confirm how many ATMs are affected because it changes constantly. Customers we talk to want Chase to waive its fees for using other ATMs if its own locations are closed. And it's like double the fees because like you've got to pay you know the ATM and then Chase also charges a fee for using an out of network ATM. We need our money. We need to get to our money in an emergency. They all close at night. That's not fair. It really is not fair. It's not fair to the customers at all.